start with sex, or rather, the lack of it. And to set the scene, welcome the Birmingham comedian who's rapidly stealing Jasper Carrot's crown, ladies and gentlemen, John Dowie. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I, thought, I thought for one second there was going to be no clapping then and Jasper Carrot could keep his crown. Um, Sue Jo will be talking later about uh, uh, sex in marriage. If the conversation's anything like the sex in my marriage, it lasts about two minutes, I would imagine. Uh, I was married for a while, <coughs> as a joke. I met my wife at a party in Birmingham in about 1977, and she looked at me across a crowded room full of people and cigarette smoke and everything, and our eyes met, and she thought to herself, one day, I'm going to divorce that man. <laughs> and I'm going to do a song now dedicated uh, to all the men in the audience. This song is for men only. information men it makes me want to swear it proves that god is round the bend and why life is unfair at a certain point you reach the peak of your love making power it happens when you're 17 and that's about an hour <laughs> doesn't that make you depressed it makes me want to weep at 17 i did have sex but only while asleep now I may make love from time to time and I try to make it good But I can't do it like I did and didn't when I could <laughs> Women have their peak as well, it makes me want to cry They reach it when they're 30 and it lasts until they die When some ageing prat gives pick-up chat, how comforting to know His penis has a sell-by date of 20 years ago <laughs> I felt sexy yesterday, my love and I caroused And by the time we'd finished, she was finally aroused And the consequence, it drives me mad, it angers and annoys That men should go out with the lads and women with the boys I wish I knew at 17 the things that I now know That though my spirit gets more keen, my flesh went long ago But my teenage years are over now, so why be sour or sad? And I've still got the acne, so I guess life's not all bad. <laughs> John Dowie, thank you very much indeed. We're going to hear some and more from him later. With the thoughts of John Dowie and something dear to his heart. John. I'm lying in the ground being et by worms, I'm dead. Don't let your kids watch this bit. Or am I having one of my funny turns? No, I'm dead. My eyes are glazed and my skin is blue. My blood's congealed, my brain is too. I look and feel like a thrown-up cup of cold stew. I'm not a living man and I come from Birmingham, I'm dead. I don't have a soul and I can't get any dole, I'm dead. My body keeps stumbling and crumbling away Bits keep dropping off every day It's hard to ask girls for a date when you stink of decay I'm lying in the coffin waiting for the last trump to sound How am I supposed to hear it when I'm six feet underground? Yes, a funny thing happened on the way to the studio tonight I got killed in a car crash We were driving along quite happily when all of a sudden the driver who's a sentimental sort of bloke, swerved to hit a cat. Next thing I know is a tree coming towards me at 100 miles an hour. Not a tree from the Evil Dead. I thought, what's this, the Mark Bowen story or what? Bang! I hit the windscreen. The whole of my life flashed in front of my eyes, and I dropped down dead from boredom. There's a hole in the ground, but I don't dig it. I'm dead. I'm dead as a dull nail, dead from my feet to my head. I'm dead as a doornail, dead as a dodo About as much use as a stringless yo-yo Unable to breathe, bellow or belch Let's look on the bright side, at least I'm not Welsh Oh no, I'm only D-E-A-D Dead, dead, ever so dead, I'm D-E-A-D Dead, dead, remarkably dead, I'm D-E-A-D